Hi guys, my name is Megan Faith and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my everyday summer makeup routine and I've been liking this a lot because it's very light. Um, there's not a lot of foundation and stuff like that that's going to be like heavy on your face which is great for the summertime. Let's just get into the video. But before we do, I just wanna point this out because I didn't point it out in my first video and it bothers me personally. My blue baskets right there. Um, I'm still in the process of redoing my room. So that is why that is the only thing that's blue compared to everything else that is white and pink. It just doesn't fit. It's from my old room and I just had to put that out there because it bothers my eye. So it might bother yours as well, but you know. So yeah, we're just gonna jump right in to the tutorial. So I'm gonna start off with my face serum. This is from Root Science. And I'm just gonna do a little squirt of that. And this is after I washed my face today. Next, I'm gonna be using my MAC Prep and Prime Spray. So I'm gonna start off with color correcting. I'm gonna put this under, like on my under eyes, which they're not awful. When I do this, it looks fine, but as soon as I go like that, you can see them. Um, so yeah, I just like to put a little bit of this on using this like orangey red shade. They call it apricot. Um, it's going to cancel out the darkness. Now I'm going to take my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Fair Beige. And this I'm going to use just a little bit. And I'm going to drag it up to make my face look lifted. And I'm also gonna put this on my blemishes and then I'm gonna put it on my eyelids a little bit as well because I am gonna do a light eyeshadow look. Um, very simple, but just to kind of like coat my eyelids, give it a nice solid uh, base. Next, I'm gonna use this light, small fluffy brush um, from Coastal Scents and I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me Powder in the shade five is fair. So when I put this on my under eye, I just like to press it in gently and then I just wipe it away. And then I just put this everywhere else that I put my concealer. Next I'm going to use some bronzer to just give my face that nice summer glow. This is the Maybelline City Bronzer and I'm going to use this big fluffy brush from Morphe which is the M527. I'm just going to put a little bit on the brush because a little goes a long way. And then I lightly just brush it on to my forehead and just everywhere else where the sun's going to hit. Now I'm going to take this Morphe brush, which is the angled brush with the little spoolie at the end. It's the M158 to do my eyebrows. So I start off brushing up on my eyebrows and I'm gonna take the Anastasia dip brow in the shade taupe if you put a little bit on this brush that's all you need like you don't need a lot on this brush at all because as soon as you put a lot on it's gonna be a dark thick line so after I brush it up I just start here and then I start doing light strokes to kind of follow the arch that I have and then work my way down the brow to the tail. And then I work my way down to the front of the brow just to fill in any bald spots that might be there. And then I brush down. <laughs> and this is how I get the top arch. And then I follow the arch. it back up 
And then if I feel like there needs to be any in the front, I'll just lightly brush up a little bit. And that's it. So it's a nice natural looking brow. And then I just do the same thing on the other side. Next, I'm gonna go in with a brow gel to finish off my eyebrows. This one, any drugstore brow gel is gonna work perfectly fine. You don't need any expensive brow gel because um, they all do the same thing. So I'm just gonna take this and I'm just gonna brush up on my brows. And this I like to do just to keep my eyebrows in place because sometimes they like to move. <laughs> Now for the eyeshadow look, I'm going to be using my Morphe 35V palette. So I'm going to start off with my Morphe M433 brush in the shade Scandal, which is right here. It's like a light tan color. I'm just going to dip that in and then I'm going to focus more on the outer corner and just move in like circular and back and forth motions. I'm going to bring it in a little bit to about the center of my eye. And then I do the same on the other eye. Then I'm going to go in with my second shade right here, which is turned on. And it's more of like an orangey shade, just to add a little bit more. And I'm going to go in with my second M433 brush. And just focus up more on the outer corner and the outer side of my eye as well. So not just in the crease, but on the lid as well. Now I'm going to take my M506 brush and use turned on again. And this one is just going to go on my lower lash line. Now I'm going to take my M124, it's just a flat brush, and I'm going to use Swipe Right, which is this shimmer right here, and I'm just going to put that on my lid. And I'm patting this on more than I'm, like, wiping it on. You want to pat it. Now I'm going to do my mascara. I use two mascaras. I use L'Oreal Telescopic and I use L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise. So I start with the L'Oreal Telescopic. Once I put a light coat on of that, then I go into the Voluminous. And then if I ended up getting any clumps, I would go back in with the Telescopic and just kind of like break up the clumps with that. Um, and then I just do the other eye. And then for my lower lash line, I just use the L'Oreal Telescopic. So if you're wondering why I use two mascaras, it's because out of my years of wearing makeup, I have yet to find a mascara that I like the application brush of and the application result. Um, so I like these two specifically because I like the hard brush of the telescopic and it also lengthens your eyelashes. And then the voluminous one, I like the fact that it helps give your eyelashes volume, but it also has a soft bristle brush, which I'm not a huge fan of. Um, so that's why I use both. Now I'm gonna take this Chanel blush in the shade Turbulent. It's a hot pink. <laughs> so I'm gonna use my Morphe E48 brush. I'm gonna lightly tap it in the blush and then lightly brush that onto my cheeks if you use too much it's going to be bright pink <laughs> but I like I still like the shade that it gives off by just using a little bit now I'm gonna use my Kylie Jenner highlighter in the shade cotton candy cream and I'm going to use my morphe m501 brush And then I also like to put it a little bit over my eyebrows on the tip of my nose. And now I'm gonna take my Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. And to finish off, I'm gonna be using my Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss in the shade Diamond Milk. So there you go. That is my everyday summer makeup look. 
this is what I do every day if I'm wearing makeup. A lot of the time, honestly, in the summer, I don't wear makeup because I'm going to the beach or I'm just lazy and don't want to put makeup on. Um, give my skin some time to breathe. But yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment if you would like to comment. And please subscribe. There will be new videos coming soon. I'm very excited to be this being my second YouTube video and many more to come. So I'm very excited for what is to come. And yeah, subscribe to follow me on the journey and be a part of it. Uh, yeah, thank you again for watching and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.